There's Shannon Hearn, come on for his first run, a booming kick. Kicked a goal in WAFL football a couple of weeks ago from about 10 metres inside the centre square. He have a bit of a tailwind, but it's still an almighty kick. He has a booming boot. Hearn stifled the bounce, did well. Runs to 52, he's a long kick, Hearn. This is a good looking effort, bends a back goal. What a start. Your football career can can, uh, does go by very quick, but you can also, well, I think I've been fortunate enough to be able to be in the system for nine years now, and you know, some players don't even get that opportunity. So, something I'm very proud of and very happy um, to achieve, but I certainly think hopefully you've got a lot more left and, uh, and a couple of things I want to do. Here he's now he can kick a long ball. This will be good from 60 metres. Shannon Hearn, yes! Early on, wanted to learn as much about football as I could, so I really enjoy um, watching good games of football, watching good players, try to learn. And I probably got to the point where I um, understand the game um, reasonably, reasonably well now. So now it's about trying to pass that on to, well, to the whole team in general, but also uh, some of the younger players because we, we, I want to be successful, but we also want to be su successful as a club. So I think if I can help pass on a bit of that knowledge, hopefully that can help fast track. And Hearn in the spot. That's his trademark. Hearn has come off and uh, made the sub for his knees. So Shepard comes on for the West Coast Eagles. Doing all the pre-season and then, yeah, coming and hurting your knee, uh, yeah, I was reasonably uh, annoyed, but it's something you have to use you learn, you learn from it, you deal with it, and you just get into the best of rehab you can, and then when you come and play, well, you, you, you try to make the most of it you can because you understand that the game changes pretty quick. Half forward, Fletcher punches the handball to Hearn, and he can, well, he's a damn buster, isn't he? He goes right over the top. Simo spoke early in the year about being um, adaptable and being able to play a few different roles. And it's something that I think uh, from a development that's what I want to be able to do is potentially go a little bit forward, a little bit in the midfield, but it, it is majority down back. To half forward, her drop back into the fly strong. And as a backman, it's, you know, I view it pretty simply. You, you've got to try to beat your bloke first, and that's from um, trying to read the play, having good positioning. And then well, when we get the ball, you know, just try to use the ball and help create space for the teammates. Um. Pass. What a kick. Just a brown. Been reasonably happy with form this year, but always believe that can do do more and have more impact. And uh, I think that's what good players can do. They have a consistently good impact, and especially when games are tight. Um, but one of the things I've actually been disappointed with is a bit of a kicking this year. So it's been a little bit annoying and frustrating. So, uh, but it's just you have to keep working with that type of stuff in training. Um, keep trying to improve and learn, learn from the past. I think. Good. Goes for distance, goes for Darling. What a kick. Oh. It quick through the air too, wasn't it? Glassy and Coxie are probably going to go down as legends of the game and uh, of the football club. And the biggest thing I think from them is they set the standard, both with their leadership but also their performance and the way they went about um, their football. And it does leave a pretty big hole, um, but I think Going forward, I think we do have the players that can cover that. We probably are a younger list, so we probably don't have, uh, you know, five, six, seven, eight players that are 28, 29, 30. But I'm really comfortable with probably uh, 22 to 25, 26 year old players. So I'm comfortable with the way it's, um, way the club's going to be. But I also think that we still need to keep our standards getting higher and higher because, you know, we've just been midfield the past two years. So it's comfortable, but we just need to keep getting the uh, results from the training track, but then also getting it out into a game. He could go long and straight. What a goal! 